Okay, and welcome to another shootout. Um, on the left, we've got my daily driver, which is uh, um, an Asus Zenbook Duo, the UX582, which is three years old now, so it's uh, clocking on a bit, a bit like me. Um, it's got an i9 processor and 32 gigs of RAM. And on the right, we've got the brand new Surface Laptop 7 um, with uh, a Snapdragon X um, Elite and 16 gigs of RAM, it's the base model. Um, both running, obviously, FL Studio. First reading I'd give you will be the percentage of processing power for the ASUS ZenBook, and the second reading will be the percentage of processing power for the Surface Laptop 7. So without further ado, let's get stuck in. Okay, and out of the gates, we've got 14 on the left versus 12 on the right. So a slight lead for the Surface Laptop 7, but the uh, three years old now, uh, BMF of the ASUS ZenBook Pro Duo are doing very well. Uh, now 13 on the left versus 14 on the right. So the ASUS ZenBook Duo slightly ahead at that point. Um, now looking at 12 on the left versus 14 on the right. So uh, similar, um, similar situation. The Asus Zenbook Duo is still slightly ahead. Um, I should add that um, the Surface Laptop 5 is uh, running in x86 emulation mode. So I'm pretty impressed that it's doing this well, actually. Um, and we're now looking at 17% on the left versus 22% on the right. It's changing very quickly. 18% on the left versus 22% on the right, 21%. Um, they're out of sync, but let's not worry too much about that. Um, let's let them catch up. In fact, I'm going to start, I start it again. That seems a bit unfair. They're both in the fast section now, and we're looking at 22% on the left versus 27% on the right. So the Surface Laptop 5 having to, Surface Laptop 7 rather having to work harder, and not surprisingly, given the fact that it's uh, running that emulation layer. 20 2% now on the left versus 28% on the right. And I'm going to give it just a few more seconds to see what happens. Um, see if there's any changes. 24%, 25% on the left versus 27, 28% on the right. So the Surface Laptop 7 having to work slightly harder. Um, but not too much in it. I'm going to stop it there. They've gone out of sync. That's an issue we probably do need to talk about at some time. They shouldn't have gone that far out of sync. Um, but uh, yeah, that's not for this um, video today. Um, so, winner was the uh, ASUS ZenBook Pro Duo, um, 32 gigs of RAM and an i9 processor. Um, doing very well in spite of its age. It's, uh, as I say, it's three years old now. Um, but you have to say that the ARM-based Surface Laptop 7 gave it a run for its money and considering that um, this isn't an ARM um, uh, application, FL Studio hasn't been recompiled for ARM, it has funny enough for um, MacBook uh, but not yet for Windows, um, it's done extremely well. Um, Surface Laptop 7 has done extremely well um, in this shootout in spite of coming in second place. So there you go. I hope that's um, been of some value. If you've enjoyed it and want to see more like this, then give it a like. And um, if you really enjoyed it, then subscribe. Thanks very much for your time. Bye bye.